Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to add games to Retrobat on your Kinect Drive. So the game I'll be adding is God of War 2. No, I will not show you where to get your games, that's a you thing. But once you have your game downloaded, copy it, like right click copy, and I'll walk you through it. So go to Core Type R, go to Collections, Computers, ROMs, and open up the Retrobat folder. In here, you need to go to ROMs, scroll all the way down to the system you're adding the game to. In my case, it's a PlayStation 2 game. So scroll down and you will see PlayStation 2, so PS2, and then open that up, go to ROMs, and pick either Europe or USA. USA has more options, so just paste it in there. So right click, copy, right click, paste, and paste it in this folder. Once you've that done, head back a bit, just go back one, go back two, and right here, Retrobat. Open up Retrobat, and you will notice the game is there, but we have no artwork, which I'll go through with you in a bit. So once we're in here, we're going to scroll up here to PlayStation 2. Again, it's the US one. You can probably hear my Xbox controller. I can just hold it, I forgot. PlayStation 2. Scroll down all the way down here to God of War. I think I can press uh, R1. Keep going, and I passed it. And as you can see, God of War 2 is now added, but I have no artwork. What is going on? Press Start, I believe, on your Xbox controller. Scroll down to Scraper. Open that up, and go to Scraper Settings. Down the very bottom of this, username and account. Do you see it down the bottom here? Username and account. I will leave a link to a website down below. Log into that website or sign up, sorry. Sign up to that website and then, you know, accept the confirmation email. It is free to sign up to this website. Free. However, if you pay, you get faster downloads. That's, I mean, if you want to, uh, what they call scrape multiple games, let's say 2,000 games. It's going to be a lot faster if you pay for it, but it's also free. Just making that, okay? It's free if you want to do one or two games. So once you've signed up to that website, again, link down below in the description, come back in here, add your username, add your password, and then go back and press scrape now. And that is all you do. It will find the artwork and all the information that is needed in order for you to get the gameplay footage. That's all. And you can do this actually with a lot of things. You can, you can go back out here and highlight an entire system, like Scrape. Scroll down here and say any missing media, all. Like as you can see right now, I have 77 selected. I don't need 77 systems selected. Select none. I can say just the PlayStation 2. Go back out, and what would I like to find? Any missing media. That's the great thing about this. It's it's built in. It's really well done. I must admit, uh, I really do like it. But that will get you your artwork. And let's load God of War as a test. And it should load with no issues whatsoever. And that is how you make a game, a <laughs> make a game. That's how you, <laughs> I can't even say it. That's how you add games to Retrobat on the Kinhag Drive. I don't like these bezels. I honestly don't like them. But yeah, that's how you get it working. Thanks for watching, and as always, hope you enjoyed the video.